welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I got, I got a fun thing for us to do right now. We don't get to do this very often, so we're going to do it really fast. We're going to do four RVs in under 10 minutes. Four vintage RVs in under 10 minutes. Let's go to it. Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, you know, I'm, I'm normally out doing campground tours and riding Little Red, showing you what there is to see in the campgrounds. And I rarely ever anymore do RV floor plan tours. But I've got the opportunity for us to take a look at the Silver Streak. That's named Lucy. I don't know what year this model RV, this travel trailer is. Got to be from the 70s, maybe. What I think is really cool is this great big trunk back here on the back with all the necessary tools for a great RV adventure. Aluminum siding. This is kind of the precursor to the, or, or, or comparable to an Airstream. Look at, the, look at the door. It's like a spacecraft. So if you want this, so if you just want the fresh air, you open that up. You always know what time it is. So I presume that turns into a bed. The table folds away. There are cats that want to come in. Old gas oven and, and stove. Through the refrigerator. That's so cool. And it's and I know that that's not original to the two twin beds, and all the way in the back we have a restroom. A shower to get clean when you're dirty. A little closet back here. Now these are set up, we're at Off the Vine RV Park in Heiko, Texas. And you can actually stay in this if you are of such a mind. Oh, well, that's cool. I dig that. All right. Hey, I don't get to do this very often. Touring RVs. This is Sue Ellen. I don't know what, what Sue Ellen is. It's, she's old, though. Don't tell her I said that. Let's see if we can find a, a label on it. I don't see a label anywhere. I really like, I like the red stripe. Makes it look fast. All right, well, got a little owie there on the corner. Sue Ellen is spacious. Look at that kitchen. You know, kitchen layouts haven't changed very much over the years. Of course, there's, there's only so much you can do in a rectangular box, right? Nice big sofa. And then that pulls out for, make a bed as well. You know, it's, there's a lot of similarities between between trailers. There's a retro refrigerator there. 
broom closet. That's nice how it, the light comes on in there. And then we have the, the potty. We're going to light in here because it's kind of dark. This one has a lots, of, lots of storage, lots of closet space. And of course, there's the that could actually be a king size bed, but they've got a queen size mattress in here. So the if that slipped that way, I think I don't know. Very cool. All right. We gotta see this RV. We've got to see this one. Why? Cause it's the dude. <laughs> the dude RV. This is a Safari Special Edition Airstream. Let's go take a look. I haven't been in too many Airstreams. Oh, look at there. So, almost an identical floor plan to the last two that we've seen, except for the large dinette. This one's a lot more modern, though. We got an actual microwave that's built in, part of the, the RV stove and a microwave. Refrigerator, two-way power, Dometic, the closet. That's a little bitty bed, though. And then we have a, the toilet. And the shower to get clean when you're dirty. All right. Those are just so cool. So that's three. Let's go see some more. Vintage Airstream. This, this is a little one. This is Maria. I don't even know if it's open. It's a land yacht. Oh, it is open. This is cool. I mean, it's not real, real big in here. You got the, the bed. That probably makes out into a twin. They've rebuilt the, the kitchen. That's kind of cool. Built that out of looks like pallet wood. Or barn wood. Oh, look at there. You got a soaking tub. Maria's kind of kind of tiny. But that's neat. Alright. Let's go see what else we can get into. Hey, if you enjoyed our tour of the four RVs in 10 minutes, please click on the subscribe button. And give us the thumbs up. Y'all come back now, you hear?